May 5th, 2015. Will it be a date that jumps off the page when it comes to the legacy of Alberta's political history, or will it be just another election day, just another Tory majority. Who would have thought one month ago when the writ dropped that here at NDP headquarters at the Westin Hotel in Edmonton, there would be talk of a potential majority government. But judging by media coverage here, a myriad of television cameras, national print reporters, and of course, radio reporters, including us here at 630 Ched, the story could be one of upheaval. It could be the end of one dynasty and the beginning of another. Will this room be full of 1,000 people screaming and cheering for Premier Notley? Or will it be a room full of people silenced by yet more momentum but no translation at the polls? We'll have to wait until 8 o'clock tonight when numbers start pouring in. And of course, the team here at 630 Ched partnering up with our colleagues over at Global to bring you comprehensive coverage on our airwaves and theirs. And of course, following our Twitter account as well would be key if you want to stay updated to developments as they happen. We can tell you that one, two, five, 10, even 15 seats won't be enough to satisfy the hundreds of people who plan to be here tonight celebrating what will be a transformational approach to governance in Alberta. But it's going to have to be more than social media momentum and talk ahead of today. It's going to have to be reflected at the polls. What looked like record turnout in the advanced polls, will it translate to that tonight? It remains to be seen what that means for the new Democratic Party here in Alberta. Also yet to be determined, this room here, a major story ground, if ever there was one, across the province of Alberta tonight. 630Ched.com is your home for comprehensive election coverage. Keep it locked right here. Stay with us throughout this evening's developments.